Hey guys, what's up? It's Sean Autotopia LA. Today we're back here at my friend Dean's SoCal Classic Car Storage. We're finally shooting with my friend Rick that we've been looking forward to shooting this car for a while. You built this whole car yourself. You, you garage built this car, right? Yeah, I, I've been a car guy for since high school. So you said it's an LS3. Yep, it's a stroker motor. It's a four, it's 427 cubic inches. It's 11 to one. It's like a 624 lift hydraulic roller. It's a crate motor. Mm -hmm. uh, makes about 625, 630 horse. So it's, it's you know, got a little bit of, of oomph. It's not like some of these other guys. And that cam gives it that extra little yep. beautiful sound. It's got sound. a nice little sound. Yeah. And then what do you make to transmission? T56, uh -huh. uh, six speed, and then it's got a Ford nine inch. Uh, -huh. uh true track with 389 gears okay so it's got healthy gears in it yeah. so it's a fun car to drive yeah you know coming over here on the freeway i was in six gear doing about 2200 rpm wow at 80 miles an hour so wow can't beat that right you got plenty of gearing so yeah. when you're down low you can oh yeah it rips and then suspension uh speed tech you're running will with discs yeah, all around on discs. it yeah. yeah your wheels stand out to me every time too what are these those are rush firth Rated X. Rushforth. Another good guy, Jason Rushforth. The it's, dish it's on the dish. rear is so bitching you know? on this. This And is it's only so a 325 good. tire. It's a, tw it's, really? a, it's a 1912 rim, and that's a 325. I can easily fit a 345 in there. Yeah. Um, but I just to play safe, in the, in the beginning, we're in, we're in a 325. Sure. 275s up front. Yep. And uh, What size wheel is up front? 1810. Got it. And okay. a 1912. So you can still go pretty big brakes though, huh? With yeah. The, oh yeah. yeah. That's like a 13 and a half uh, rotor. Okay. So it's pretty healthy. And what exhaust are you running? Because the tone is... Yeah, those are, those are uh, Black Widows. They Venoms. are? They're the Venom 250s, yeah. Got it. Three inch stainless, all tigged. My buddy up north, uh, Mike from King Muffler, welded the whole exhaust. Uh, did a really good job. Carlos from my, my painter was the one that talked me into the hockey stripe because I wasn't sure what I wanted to do. Yeah. He convinced me that would be good in the color. And then we yeah. welded like, you know, we welded the grills shut. Oh, you sure on did. The, on yeah, the cowl yeah, panel. Yeah. Just yeah. stuff like that. And I so love all fun. the carbon accent points you yeah. have on here as well. Your mirrors, your rear bumper, the spoiler. Oh, and then I wanted a deluxe interior. I wanted deluxe door panels, but I wanted something, some cool seats. Yeah. And, and I, you know, I don't want to have like what everybody else has. So I yeah. wanted Recaro's and I thought, you know what? The, the Sportsters are pretty cool seats. They're bitching seats. Those I are mean, really Sportsters nice. Sportsters are bitching seats. So I'm like, you know what? Let's just get Sportsters. And then I, that's a 2016 Camaro Center console. These yeah. door panels are great. They almost, it almost looks like an original door panel, yeah. but not. Just so many great details on just here, little dude. stuff yeah led lights under the dash you know uh -huh. just all the stuff that uh -huh. you want to have oh yeah is that a quick release wheel? yeah that's a quick release wheel mm -hmm. momo steering wheel and then the the energy uh hub i love these too how is that yeah. ring brothers those are ring brothers they are yeah, yeah, yeah. just like the hinges the hinges are uh, ring brothers uh-huh well cool dude let's let's throw some cameras in here and we'll go do the fun part which is okay. the driving part. cool we're right gonna on. go for a drive you guys thing to fall in love with someone else's car but this thing's bitching dude I mean it steers just nice it feels I like the I really like the way your suspension set and that it feels stiff enough that you've got handling yeah but it's still like this is not overkill yeah, yeah. It's a total smooth it's a comfortable yeah car. these seats are great yeah and I diamanted the shit out of this car it's got Dynamat everywhere. 
some places double. You know, I just I guess wanted that's it to why be I can solid. Hear it loud enough outside, but yeah. in here it's not. Yeah, it's horrible. not too bad. Plus now you've got cup, cup holders. Cup holders, man. Cup holders are awesome. I'm so old at this point, dude. I love dude, cup holders. Cup holders are great. I use them all the time. So one of the questions I like asking people too is, like, why a '69? Are you are you a '69 Camaro guy? Is it one of your uh, favorites? Yeah, it's always been one of my favorites. Like my last Camaro was a '67. I had a couple of '69s in high school. Okay. Um, I've always had. I've always liked the body lines on this car. Yeah. I just think they look cool. They are sexy. Yeah, just the little bit of a turn right there, you can feel you can this. Feel it. This car is set up to drive, dude. Yeah, it drives good, huh? It really does, yeah. It's bitching. And then we could, we could U-turn it. I usually use this hotel here. Right here? Yeah. It just works out easy, so I get you know. Over zealous there. No, that's great, dude. Are you kidding me? I love it. In second gear. So go ahead, yeah. Car moves great. I like to beat it up a little bit. You know, dude, it's not making full power either. It's just not right now. I can tell. You can tell. I think when I get it tuned, it's gonna, it's gonna. That's gonna make it really fun. Yeah. Cause I, I, I'm just, we had some issues with our ECU and uh, got got it all shaken out. Uh, we were blowing these O2 sensors for some reason. Interesting. And uh, we got it fixed, but I never put a proper tune on it after that. I've only got like 700 miles since then. Yeah. Driving around Huntington Beach a little bit here and there. So not really having the opportunity to, to, to really, dig in on yeah, it. To really, yeah. yeah, you know, just having. I love how much brake you have on here. Oh, there's so much brake. Right? Dude, this thing will freaking throw you. Oh yeah, I, I can tell. A face full of dash. I can tell. It, it, the Hydra Boost and the, and the Will Woods. Yeah. I didn't know it was gonna break this well. This is by far one of my favorite cars that we've seen out at the Quarantine Cruise. Here's a few more that we found at the Quarantine Cruise as we say goodbye and thanks for hanging and watching what we do. We'll see you in the next episode, you guys. Later.